Hello and welcome to episode 49 of Treasure Hunting for Nostalgia, Game Show Edition. This is Brandon. This is Matt. This is Brad. Brian. Nick. Matt. Tim. Full House. Newcomer on board, Brian. Would you like to introduce yourself? My name is Brian. <laughs> <laughs> That's just as good as uh, Tim's introduction. We asked him on 34 and 35. If he would like to uh, introduce himself, then no. <laughs> <laughs> so we have already drawn for teams. Uh, this game show is going to be broken up into three parts. The first part will be Family Feud. The second part will be Trivia and the Shockmaster. <laughs> and then the third will be a video game tournament. Does anyone have any questions? No. <laughs> I mean, was the family few people from your work again with the ridiculous answers? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I think I only sent it to five of them. What I did was created a survey monkey and sent it through Facebook and online uh, chat forums and uh, had them take it. So I ended up with about 60 responses. So it's pretty varied. This is going to be from answers from your favorite Facebook fan, your Uncle Ron. <laughs> <laughs> he, did not, he did not respond to the survey. <laughs> okay, so we have already drawn for teams. We have Matt, Brad, and Brian on team one, with Brian being the captain. And then on team two, we have Tim, Matty G, and Nick, with Nick being the captain. So... We could do a roll off to see who goes first. Matt and Tim, please roll the die. Three. So you get to go first. It's good thought right there. Thank you. So <laughs> this is what happened. Tim rolled a one, <laughs> and Matt rolled a three. So he's going to go first. Okay. There's a little twist on this family feud. There always is. Uh, we bumped it up from three strikes to five strikes. And including the top answers on the board, there are also cool picks <laughs> and the dishonorables. <laughs> the cool picks and the dishonorables each only got one vote, but I deemed them worthy to be cool picks or they suck so bad I named them the dishonorable. If you guess one of these cool picks or dishonorables, you personally get five points if you could tell me if I put it on the cool pick side <laughs> or the dishonorable side. Question one. Hold on. How are you keeping score? I have paper. Oh, okay. Just checking. You need this pen? I have pen. Oh, we also have bonus points to give out. Since it was Nick's birthday yesterday, he got ten bonus points. Uh, Matt, since he brought me a go girl, he got fifteen <laughs> bonus points. <laughs> And Which Matt? Matt. Yes. <laughs> but these are individual. Okay. Do we answer as a team? What website do you visit on a daily basis? Facebook. Number one answer. <laughs> 17 people said Facebook. Do you actually poll people on Facebook? <laughs> <laughs> Brad? Oh, man. Um, Pinterest. Cool pick or the dishonorable? <sighs> Dishonorable. That is correct. <laughs> Brian? Google. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> First try. Matt? Let's say some sort of uh, porn website. Can you be more specific? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Strike. <laughs> no one said porn. They didn't want to admit that. <laughs> Brad? YouTube. YouTube is a number two answer. 15 people. Brian? Instagram. No, no Instagram. Eh. Strike three. Matt? Sorry, yeah. Yahoo? No Yahoo. <laughs> Four strikes. IMDb. Fifth strike. Chance to steal. Amazon, eBay. Uh, what are you thinking? I was thinking CNN, but Amazon's pretty good. I don't think people go to Amazon every day, though. Like Craigslist. <laughs> yes, I mean, I'm just thinking out, I'm thinking out loud, man. <laughs> Offer something better, then you can start talking shit. I was at CNN. I go to CNN every day. I read the news. 
people go on the internet to be entertained. <laughs> a lot of people don't, aren't entertained by the news anymore. Uh, team two, we need an answer. What do you got? I don't know. Out of all of our answers, I'll go with Amazon. You want to go with Amazon? Yeah. yeah. We'll go Amazon. No Amazon. Uh, okay, for life. So team one gets the 17 and the 35. So eBay probably. Was it Twitter? Because they checked. Twitter's Amazon. good. Okay. So I did forget to mention this. Um, if. <laughs> If you do, when you steal the answer, if you get a cool pick or the dishonorable, <laughs> you do get the points. You just don't get the five point for individual. You just get the bank. Uh, number three on the list, Reddit, with nine people. Then Craigslist. Oh. <laughs> and then the other cool picks, there were only two cool picks. AOL and eBay. Oh, wow. <laughs> I mentioned three and two of them were on there. Yeah. The wrong one. Yeah. Team two. You when did you send that survey out? AOL. <laughs> <laughs> AOL was definitely a cool pick. Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> if you were visited by a genie, what would you wish for? You cannot wish for more wishes. Five answers on the board. Um, money. Number one answer. Uh, to live forever. Immortality or something? No. no. Strike one. A baller house. House. Home. Strike two. What? Oh, man. That's what I was going to say. Um, how about a cool automobile? Strike three. What? Uh, to be able to fly? Number three answer. Superpower. Uh, I, I, I vac vacation, I guess. I don't know. Strike four. Um, better job? No, no job. Team one gets a chance to steal. Three answers still up. Yeah. He, he, two, saw, he surveyed a bunch of women, though, so they could have all said, like, lose weight or something. What? They want AOL stock. <laughs> <laughs> AOL stock. So you guys should go with it. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to say to bring someone back to life. <laughs> That is not on there. Number two, a lot of people said more genies. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you do with those genies because you can't wish for more witches after that. So, gang bang. <laughs> <laughs> the next one, number four, hottest girl on the earth. <laughs> number five, and world hunger. Okay. Or cool house. <laughs> <laughs> cool pick. Best sandwich ever, at least one thousand feet long. <laughs> I was thinking that too. <laughs> <laughs> to be on treasure hunting for nostalgia. <laughs> <laughs> and then the dishonorable. Someone said nothing. <laughs> So, 23 points to Team 2. How come the had set the genie free like a lot of you? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Team 1, question number 3. Name a TV show you watched as a kid. Is it on, who's it on, me or Matt? Uh, we'll oh, sorry, last Yeah, so. Full House. Number 3 answer. Three people. This one was all over the place. There's yeah. a lot of dishonorable, or two dishonorables, and yeah, five cool yeah, watch your demographic. Brian? America's Funniest Home Videos. That is not on there. Good <laughs> answer, though. Uh, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. That is not on what? there. What? Not ever. <laughs> 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 Little House on the Prairie. <laughs> no. <laughs> Three strikes. Step by step. <laughs> step by step is not on there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Line up. Boy Meets World. Boy Meets World is not oh, on there. Oh, ever. Chance to steal. Uh, I was thinking Simpsons right away. Probably, but I don't know if that's what people are actually oh, thinking. You make the decision, make the decision, man. I think you go with Simpsons. Well, I'm the captain, so it's my decision. Uh, <laughs> 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 this is a good job last time. Uh, <laughs> 
<laughs> CNN wasn't on that list. Yeah, no, that would definitely was. The three wasn't. of mine were on there. I'd, I'd say Simpsons. <laughs> we'll go Simpsons. That is a cool pick. Only one person said yeah. Simpsons. You guys get the three points for Full House. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Number one, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh. Number two. That's a cartoon, not a TV show. <laughs> it's a, it's so a it's show. <laughs> uh, Saved by the Bell. DuckTales. Oh, I was going to say Tales of Tales. Pokemon. And then Star Trek. Huh. Cool picks. Yu-Gi-Oh! Rugrats. <laughs> Small Wonder. The Small S- Wonder. <laughs> <laughs> the Simpsons. Arthur, Xena, Warrior Princess, <laughs> Jackie Chan Adventures, uh, and then the Dishonorables, Hey Arnold, and Party of Five. <laughs> oh, man. What do you get for the cool pick again? Uh, if you Nothing, because we stole. Yeah, you stole. Uh, <laughs> but if it, you get it individually, you get five points. Okay. I think the rationale is that we all can be right, together. Right, right. So, so who they, that's, yeah. Which movie? Oh, I'm sorry. Team two. Team two. Which movie villain frightened you as a child? Jason. Jason is a number two answer. Pennywise. Pennywise, number four answer. I'll go with Freddy Krueger. Number one answer. Of course. Michael Myers. Ooh, Michael Myers is not on here. Ah. It's about the extent of my knowledge. <laughs> uh, Leatherface, or whatever his name is. Leather, that's strike two. Candyman? Candyman, very frightening. Not on the list. Uh, Killer Clowns? No. That- <laughs> Aaron? <laughs> <laughs> is that what he said? No, he said Pennywise. Something different. And one, one more strike, yes. How many do we have right so far? You have three out of five. Uh, man, this, this is not my my ballpark. <laughs> Twenty nine points on the board. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm just gonna be stupid and say Howard the Duck. I have no idea. That is your fifth strike. I know. <laughs> you, guys, you guys, you guys gotta talk about it. Yeah. So what? What is it? What's the question? What movie villain? Movie villain as a child. I think Dracula. Yeah. Dracula. Dracula is not on the list. Yes. What about mine? My personal Large Mars. Oh, uh, wow. <laughs> large Mars? <laughs> no. no large no. Mars. Number three? Chucky. Ooh. Oh. Uh, then number five? The Devil. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Boogity on there? Uh, so Mr. then we've got Cool Picks. Someone said Damien Sandow. <laughs> what? <laughs> was that you? No. <laughs> when they were growing up? Was it when Who they said were Damien Sandow? It might have been Sam or Jordan. Because <laughs> <laughs> they're still a kid, so. <laughs> the Predator. Ooh, that's uh, someone said Joker, Heath Ledger. But that's only a few years old. And then some of the last cool pick was Hunter from Bambi. <laughs> that was a cool pick? Yeah. And then the Dishonorable, there were two. The Joker, Jack, Nichol- J- Jack Nicholson version. And then any any old guy. <laughs> any old guy. <laughs> <laughs> the Joker, Jack Nicholson was Dishonorable. Yeah. <laughs> but Heath Ledger was honorable. Yeah. 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 The villain in Howard the Duck was heck of a Oh, yeah. Movie. Howard. The child molester guy. <laughs> I don't even remember. Is he a real child molester? Yeah, that's the, the principal from Ferris Bueller. Um, yeah. Was it something Jones? Something Jeffrey like Jones. Yeah. Jeffrey and, Jones. And he really did it? No, he just liked to look at little boys with their dicks out and cowboy hats on. That's different than the last thing. He <laughs> <laughs> liked dicks and cowboy hats. Little hairless dicks and cowboy hats. <laughs> Come on now, it's not this far from a last name. <laughs> so he would like Justin then. <laughs> <laughs> you know this for a fact? No. Oh. <laughs> team two. Or is it team one? That's what you want. Name a musician you would hang out with. Brian. There's only four answers on here, but a ton of cool picks <laughs> and some dishonorables. 
I'll say Michael Jackson. Number four answer, M. Shadows. M. Shadows is not on That's there. It's pretty lame you wearing that t-shirt and saying that. <laughs> <laughs> Prince. Prince is the number three answer. What? <laughs> He's like a sociopath. <laughs> there are five points on the board right now. Marky Mark. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> He's <laughs> not on the list. Uh, what's his name? Anthony. Singer for Aaron October. No. Three strikes. Oh, I just had one too. Jay Z. No. Oh. Four strikes. Justin Bieber. Oh, no. <laughs> A lot of people. Us, right? yeah. Yeah. A lot of people love Justin Timberlake. That's exactly what I was saying. Justin Timberlake. Yep. Timberlake, Justin Timberlake. I would say he is not on the uh, list. Yeah, some girl. Uh, so Lady five Gaga. points to Team One. Uh, number one, Freddie Mercury. Ah, oh, be tight. We can do dead people, huh? Yeah. Someone did Michael Jackson. <laughs> I was thinking Elvis Presley. If we're gonna do Michael Jackson. <laughs> number two, Eminem. Ugh. Cool picks. Flavor Flav, <laughs> The Rock, he sang once. So. <laughs> Someone actually wrote that. It doesn't. Tommy Lee, Tommy Lee. Kiss Guy <laughs> with Long Tongue. <laughs> These people win hepatitis. <laughs> Brett Michaels, Nobuo Uematsu. Nice. nice. That's like a tight. Beethoven. <laughs> Beethoven. <laughs> <laughs> what? He was have one of those little horn things that sticks in his ear. <laughs> Snoop Dogg, Rob Zombie, The Hanson Brothers, Fuck <laughs> Flea, Les, Les Claypool, Dave Grohl. I believe those came from Joe Coverbius. If you have ten dollars, you can hang out with Hanson Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> you could have got that for your birthday, fucking like, like twenty bucks. You could have gone to perform. Billy Joel, New Kids on the Block, <laughs> Dishonorables, Neo, Mariah Carey, Jessica Simpson, Madonna, and Snoop Lion. <laughs> <laughs> Team two. If you traveled back in time to the 15th century, what item would you take back with you? Huh. Seven answers on the board, and a bunch of cool picks, and some dishonorables. I was going to say cell phone, but I don't think it would really do anything back then. <laughs> do, you, do, you, do you mean take back to the 15th century, or take back to the 21st century? Take back with you to the 15th century. Oh. I'll just go generic and say computer. Computer is not on the list. I, I was thinking machine gun or the gun in general, I was thinking that too. like Ash style. <laughs> Number one answer. Yeah. Uh, variations were musket, uh -huh. pistol, and boomstick. Uh, um, just say what you think. Just say five. Let's see. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it makes that answer. Yeah. A car. Car is a number three answer. Airplane. No. Airplane is not on the list. Um, I don't know. Encyclopedia? Textbooks slash information. Yeah. Well, Ash that. Uh, electricity? Some form of electricity? No. Three strikes so far. Three more answers on the board. I'm sorry, four. Video games. Video games is not on the list. Um, I have no idea. Um, I haven't got one right after yet. Anyway. <laughs> How about... Pornography. No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> chance to steal. Music. Music is not on the list. Number four, time traveling machine. I guess if you're going back, it must theoretically exist, right? <laughs> <laughs> Number five, sword, titanium short sword or a Swiss army knife. Number six, medicine. Oh, oh. Is that, is that, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Number seven, phone. <laughs> That's what so are you gonna call? <laughs> <laughs> cool picks. 
Mountain Dew or soda. Nice. Bacon. I think they'll have pigs. <laughs> <Yeah>. Necronomicons. <laughs> Chainsaw. A kilt. A Viking warship. Who's that kilt? <laughs> <laughs> a real crown. <laughs> title of royalty. And the dishonorables. A tank. Sunglasses. And a golden nugget. Sunglasses. I think some people misunderstood your question the way that Tim misunderstood it. Like, bring back from the 15th century. Yeah, a lot more like stuff that was like already back then. <laughs> One. Name your favorite comic book character. Spider-Man. Number two answer. Wolverine. Number four answer. Colossus. Colossus is not on the list. Deadpool. Deadpool is not on the list. Batman. Batman number one answer. Two more to go and there's some cool picks and dishonorables. Captain America. Captain America is not on the list. Gambit. Gambit is not on the list. That's two, five, right? Two more strikes. They are three strikes. Venom. Venom. Cool. Oops. <laughs> I knew it was a cool pick. Okay. You did that earlier, too, when you said cool pick. Did I? No. Uh, Brian. Superman. Number three answer. One more to go. Two strikes left. The Hulk. The Hulk is not on the list. That was that's what I was gonna say. One more. Iron Man. Ever since uh, Mark Ruffalo took over for Edward Norton, people stopped liking the Hulk. Iron Man. Iron Man is not on the list. Chance to steal. That was gonna be my guess. <laughs> yeah. Aquaman. Aquaman. <laughs> that's one of the main ones. He has the gayest the superpower. It could be a dishonor. He's like the only comic book character ever to have a movie. <laughs> He did on Entourage. Um, what I want to think of. It said superheroes, right? I bet you some of the top like character. Someone, no, some, Magneto? You know Someone Magneto said like Star Wars. <laughs> One of those guys from Watchmen, like Rorschach or something like that. But I, I think Magneto is probably the best one. Magneto? Yeah. We're going to go uh, Magneto. Not on the list. Was Aquaman? <laughs> Aquaman. <laughs> Number five? Harley Quinn. Hmm. Five people said Harley Quinn. Did Patrick, did Patrick say that? Uh, probably, I don't know. They didn't say Superman better than for heck of a long time. I know. Cool picks. Guts from Berserk. <laughs> <laughs> Piccolo from Dragon Ball. Nightcrawler. Dishonorables. Jean Grey. Yeah. She sucks. Wonder Woman. Angel. And Garfield. Come on, I'm not She's a woman. Stop. I'm just Team two. Who's the best street fighter? Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, Number are. one answer. Blanca. Number two answer. Did you fill this out? No. <laughs> Ken. Ken. Number three answer. Two more to go. I'm Chun Chun Lee. Chun Lee, number four answer. Guile. Sweet. Dang. I almost said you have Cool there. picks. <laughs> Darun. Oh, we don't get a PSM. No. Okay. I'm sorry. Dan. <laughs> That's a cool pick. Bison. <laughs> Vega. <laughs> DJ. Dishonorables. Balrog. <laughs> Saget <laughs> and Corinne. No, it's a dozen perms. Probably. I always say it because it rhymes with faggot. <laughs> okay, you guys. Team one, name a movie with great special effects. Matrix. Matrix, not on the list. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> it's fucking bullshit. <laughs> uh, Transformers. Transformers is not on the list. <laughs> Avatar. <laughs> Number one answer. Avengers. Number four answer. 
Frozen. <laughs> <laughs> Dishonorable mention. <laughs> three strikes. <laughs> Star Wars. Number three answer. That Matrix one got me shooken up. <laughs> two strikes left. Matrix two. Yeah. <laughs> Star Trek. Two. Not on the list. Army of Darkness. <laughs> cool kick. <laughs> <laughs> That is correct. (laughs) (laughs) Iron Man. Not on the list. Five strikes over to Team Two. Oh, shit. You got something in mind? Well, I, we were watching Mary Poppins last night, and I understand that one for best Academy Award for best special effects right here. <laughs> I don't know why it's funny. One of the Academy Award. I was thinking Jurassic Park for its time, but I was thinking Michael Pye. That was pretty good recently. Michael Pye is very good. You're right. It would, it would be. Other I think Jurassic Park would be more. Lord of the Rings. All right, Jurassic Park. That is on the list. Yeah. Uh, and the steel. Mary Poppins cool pick? No. <laughs> <laughs> number two, Lord of the Rings. Oh. And then number six, The Terminator. Cool pick, The Thing. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing Spider-Man. Uh, Cloverfield. Independence Day. And then if you would have said Independence Day, I would you could have gotten five points for guessing the best line of the movie. Duh. Peace, no peace. When Will Smith says, "Welcome, Welcome to, to Earth," Earth. <laughs> <laughs> the dishonorable summons up with James Bond. Final Family Feud question: Team Two, who is the best video game character? Oh man! Five answers on the board. Uh, I think it's actually me, Mario. Number two answer. Bullshit. <laughs> Luigi. Number four answer. Going Link. Number one. Two more. Mega Man. Number five. Oh, that's a tight guess. Donkey Kong. Cool pick or dishonorable? Ooh. Dishonorable. I'm going to say dishonorable. Five points to Nick. Yeah, it's uh, Donkey Kong. <laughs> 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 right, I was going to go Ryu. No. No. Um, um, Sonic the Hedgehog. That's the most stupid answer. <laughs> I was going for a dishonorable. <laughs> I already knew what I was going to say. Sonic is not on the list. I know what you're. I know you're. <laughs> um, Ganondorf. Not on the list. I'm looking around the room and all your paraphernalia. Is that where the Ryu and Ganondorf came from? No. Uh, no. I'm looking now. I, I would think it would have to be some Nintendo, but how about Pac-Man? No. Huh? That would have been a dishonorable. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Kratos. No, no Kratos. Like, Chance of Steel. I, I know a lot of girls like Peach and Yoshi and... Yeah, or... Who's the guy from Castlevania? Simon Belmont. Yeah. Yeah. Alucard. Do you have any honorable or dishonorable mentions? Yeah, there's cool picks and dishonorables. Which one's a cool pick? Tell many of each. Oh, um, there's three dishonorables, six honorables. It might be that or Alucard. You're the captain. Make the decision. Sorry. Don't let the captain influence you. He wanted to say that. Putting a list on one or Alucard. What are those little ghost guys? It's clearly Alucard. What are those guys' names? We'll go with Belmont. That is not on the list. Uh, I was thinking Samus. Samus on the it? number three answer, Alucard. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that? It's <laughs> one of those science books. From, from Castlevania. Cool picks. Sabin from Final uh, Fantasy. Oh, uh, that's tight. Terry Bogard. <laughs> <laughs> Bowie from Shining Force 2. <laughs> yes. Gabriel from Castlevania. You guys said Simon Belmont, right? No, we just said Belmont. Oh, I guess I should have got clarification. They said Simon Belmont. Yeah, I would assume it was. You said Simon, Simon Belmont. Belmont. Don't no, we said Belmont. You said Simon Belmont like five times, yeah. and then he said Belmont. Yeah. <clears throat> I was going for a general Belmont. Why is there more than one Belmont? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, number, the next one, Ramza from Final Fantasy Tactics. 
And then Pyro, the, um, or Spyro, Spyro Dragon. The dragon. <laughs> <laughs> Dishonorables, Gordon Freeman from Half-Life, Half-Life. Sora from Kingdom Hearts, and Tails. Sonic? Yeah, Sonic doesn't deserve to be on there. <laughs> okay, now we're going to roll for captains again. We're going to change it up. Brian? Brian Brad. Cut that out. It's recording. <laughs> <laughs> Is it? Oh. <laughs> I just want to test it. Do you feel that, Nick? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it goes 20 because... Each... Every time you push it, 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 you feel it. Yeah, see, that's one. Then you have to push it twice. To oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, so you just have it so you can go up that high. Yeah. Right and... now with that dial or whatever. Yeah. yeah. And I could have it... Okay. We've got new teams for Team 2. Round two. Round two, we've got Nick, Brad, and Tim. Captain of team one is Brad. Captain of team two is Brian, with Brian and both Max. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Trivia challenge and the Shockmaster. There are three main categories here. You might want to say who's playing the Shockmaster. Oh, I will when we get... Okay. Oh. Brad is playing at the Shockmaster once again. One team member will, will, will wear the Shockmaster for each main category. When it is your turn to choose, you automatically start the bid off with two seconds. So if Nick is the first to choose the uh, category, he will have a bid of two seconds automatically <laughs> at the highest level possible of the shock treatment. So the levels aren't in question. It's always 10? Always 10. The only thing in question is bidding on seconds. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> now, if you're confident in uh, after I give you the category, you could bid 10 seconds automatically or pass the bid off to your, to your opponent, to your team, I'm sorry. So even if Matt thinks he's, he's strong in the category, he could bid 10 seconds, but Matt would get Matt G would get shot. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I'm the one answering in sports. No, it, you're answering, but... It's a team thing. So if they think they know it, <laughs> they could be. <laughs> I don't even think I can go one second on level 10. Does it work all the way up to level 10? Like you have to sit there and work all the yeah, way up? Yeah, no, no, it's, it's automatic. Right? No, it's not. No, I have to do. <laughs> that sucks. To just make it clear, you guys are going to be hooked up to it too. So. <laughs> they will be. Don't tell them to do on the captain. So right now we have Nick taking the shock for the sports category and Maddie G taking the shock for his team. After the sports are done, we'll then switch to the second category, monsters, and two other individuals will be chosen. And finally, video games with a third person who has not got shocked yet will get shocked. <laughs> now, once bidding is commenced, I will then ask the question. If you get the question incorrect, you get shocked for that many seconds you bid. If you get it right, you get five points. Now, there are certain stipulations for certain categories. For example, in sports, if we pick poker, we will be playing poker for five rounds. And I'll explain <laughs> that when the time comes. <laughs> to give some relief to Matty G, you will, no one will get shocked during the poker category. <laughs> you ready? Um, Is it the first to answer? Or do we no, it's or? alternating bidding on seconds. Um, Tim, you're going to grab those two sheets of paper. Oh, man. Please give one to the other team. These are your categories. Sports, we have baseball. Uh, the, first cate- the first question is related to wild card bitches. The second question related to tales from a strange land. So forth and so on. So, uh, roll to see who goes first. Tim and Matt, you can roll. Four. Two. So, Tim, please choose your, your category you want to start off with. So, anything on the space here? Yes. Uh, I'll miscellaneous for one. Okay. That's what I feel most confident in. Miscellaneous for one. <laughs> 
You guys start the bid with two seconds. So the thing with miscellaneous is you do not know which category it's going to be first. So you're saying team one starts the bidding? Yes, I have two seconds. I guess I'll start it too. They got it. Good. <laughs> do you guys want to go for... <laughs> We'll go for four seconds. <laughs> you guys feel confident? I don't. I, Brian is a wild card, man. He can, he can bid for Matt. And yes, and Tim, and Brad could bid I, for I, you. He's going to just punish his brother. <laughs> <laughs> if, if they get it wrong, does Nick get shocked for four seconds? No. Um, it's your, You guys are going to answer the question. So since you took over the bid, you now have to answer the question. And if you get it wrong, it's four seconds. Okay. Uh, but can't we bid higher? Yes. Six seconds. Dick. <laughs> <laughs> we'll stay there. Okay. I'm going ten seconds on mine all full board. <laughs> have you done it before? Huh? Have no. you done it before? I haven't done it before. And I have. It sucks. Yeah. Ten and ten, it sucks. Okay. Uh, you should lower the level or, or make the level of play or something yeah. like that. Okay. That's brutal. <laughs> Miscellaneous first question. This sports scoring system is as follows. One and two points for a white ring, three and four points for a black ring, five and six points for a blue ring, seven and eight points for a red ring, nine and ten points for a yellow ring. <laughs> These are real sports. Uh-huh. Not footage. I don't know what the fuck that is. I've never heard of anything like that. What's is a sport it, where they use rings? Huh? Curling? No, it's definitely not curling. I don't know of any sports that they use rings like that. That's up for you. <laughs> you said it was a little sick He said they're real sports. Red, blue. What's the colors again? Red, blue, black. One point white, or one and two point white. Three and four point black. Five and six point blue. Seven and eight point red. Nine and ten point yellow. The ski ball? That's, that's the only thing that really makes sense, but it's not a sport. It's fine sport. <laughs> Anything you could compete in and win trophies or medals. That's not what it is. No. <laughs> archery? Archery. That's the only archery, archery. Is archery, like a archery aiming thing. Yeah, we'll go with archery. Archery. You are correct. I'm done. I was thinking that, but it just. Uh. Number two. You guys start the bid off with two seconds. Oh, you can we choose two, three, nope. four, or five. Do we have to pick? Yeah, two, three, four, or five. Let's say it with miscellaneous? Uh-huh. Two. <laughs> four. No, 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 no. Here's two. two. Yeah. Oh, two. Oh, okay. But you automatically bid two. Yeah. So unless you want to go higher. Oh, right. So uh, two? He's at four. I'll do four. four. I'll say five for us. <laughs> you have to go sit at the bench. Just, just let him do it. Let's just see what happens. No, it could be It could be odd. Oh, yeah. Oh, I thought you said the two. So five. I'll do six. Just let's see what happens. <laughs> seven. <laughs> I can't do seven seconds on that. He's I've gonna, done this before. Do I'm going to rip the thing off. I can't do that. It's okay. It doesn't say that it has to be on you for seven seconds. <laughs> that seven seconds is so We're, long. You don't understand how long it is to get shot. <laughs> I'll let him do it. See what happens. <laughs> Unless you guys want to do for me. He's, he's going to have a miscarriage, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I've done these before. They are not fun. You don't have to go poo right now, do you? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Seven what, seconds. Seven seconds. Time. Question two. What is knocked down in the sport known as bowling? Better not be a fucking trick. <laughs> if it's not pin, I'm taking this off. <laughs> <laughs> Brandon wrote it and it's butt plug. <laughs> You're lucky Brandon's not the shock master. <laughs> What's that other name? Well, I didn't know there was another name. There's another name for him. It's, if it's Pin, I'm going to laugh. Not this far. Not a trick. <laughs> it's a trick. It's a trick. I'm going to go with Pin. That is correct. <laughs> that was like a two minute sweat. <laughs> three, four, five for this Three. I mean, they're, they're numbers, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll bid four seconds. I'll let him try it. Do you agree with that or do yeah. you want to go? <laughs> <laughs> Which country 
has the most Olympic gold medals in bobsled. <laughs> <laughs> That's a hard one. That, it's just a random it, guess. It is. I know the answer. Yeah, you don't. <laughs> yeah, you don't. I know the answer. It's not Jamaica, dude. <laughs> I know the answer. <laughs> just don't know. You wait until he answers first. It's, it's like it's one. It's like a Nordic type country, probably like Norway or Sweden or something like that. Russia. Could be some Russia. No, it's Sweden. Sweden. What do you think, Captain? Sweden's fine. All right, we'll do Sweden. What was your guess, Brian? Switzerland. Germany. Yeah, that was my guess. Oh, I don't want to be the shock master anymore. <laughs> so, uh, four seconds? <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll time it. Well, what are you doing it on? That, okay. You just can't count? You don't think you can count four? <laughs> he's, got, he's got a timer over there. <laughs> when you start pushing, I'll start pushing. <laughs> I'm feeling like yeah. I mean, oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's not on. <laughs> okay, ready? Go. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> 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 crying about that. <laughs> he was smiling. I think he is, that, is that amplitude all the way up to you? Yeah. He was smiling and that was like I was about to cry oh, over there. Block. <laughs> <laughs> so, it has to be on 10. That's all I'm saying. Is the half four and five. Go four or five. Miscellaneous five. Two, two seconds. Do you guys want to go any hurt higher? I'll say four seconds. Six. I'll go seven. Oh, man. <laughs> Eight. Ten. <laughs> you got to leave. <laughs> if I said nine, you would have said ten. <laughs> All right. Automatic cap in the movie by this hack named Stanley Kubrick, The Shining. Jack Torrance runs around with an axe. In the TV film adaption, <laughs> what weapon is used instead of an axe? The, that is a piece of equipment, uh, sports equipment. It's the other name for bowling pin. <laughs> <laughs> I think I know it too. Um, I think it's a croquet mallet. Or a mallet. Uh, if, if you're comfortable with that, man, I'd say go with it. I mean, <laughs> yeah. If you're confident, I mean, it's so Hold awesome on. when you say that. The it's movie a, one you said? The TV one. The yeah, TV. Yeah, it was on. Um, it's a three part miniseries that yeah. also went on to DVD, which I have. <laughs> and it is way better than the. Shut up! Stanley Kubrick edition. Uh. <laughs> it's a, a jock shot. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's what it is. It's wheeling a jock shot like a sling. I think it's croquet mount. Brad! That is correct. Oh, oh good job. Wow. I knew it. See? I, I knew it right away, but I was like double guessing myself. You can't. I don't know. Do I get bonus points if I shock him? No. <laughs> Come on. So are the seconds points in? No. It's always four or five points. I mean, five points. This is whoever gets the five points. Oh, man. Who gets the points. Oh, man. I'll do uh, four. Four. Final four, one. Four for four. Four seconds? Yeah. Six seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Eight. We already are ahead. Uh, what is the current score? Well, for this category, you guys have two and they have one. And then no one has any because... If they get it, they talk it. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing this to torture you on purpose. He said eight, so I wouldn't say nine, because I knew that if I say nine, he'd say ten. Yeah, so but I then think we get it, though. Then you have ten seconds, though. I think we should say nine, and then give him a chance to say ten. All right, all right. Nine seconds. I'm cool with him doing nine. <laughs> <laughs> that means we'd go up three to one. That's, that's a pretty good lead. That's cool. I want ten. Oh, man. Oh. 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 I see his ass get shocked. I didn't see it. I was going to cry. <laughs> In 1897, oh, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Name any fishing lore. Uh, Jim, confident in that? <laughs> I, I don't know. I, I hate fishing. Worm. I don't think that's a lore. Jake, then I would say Jake. 
I would, what is that? Can you define that? It's got like things all over it. Okay. Well, jig. Worm would have been acceptable as well. The jig one? Yeah. We could have got that really quickly. I don't think we would have. Would Spinner been one of them? Yeah. Damn. Yeah, we would have. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Sardine. <laughs> so we have to re. So basically, anything to catch a fish. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna be a hook, man. right? Yeah. yeah. So now you're doing. Now there's baseball, basketball. All right. So we're done with sports, right? right? No. <laughs> Was Chum on there? Yeah, Ch- Chum's on there. <laughs> this is gonna take forever. That's. Pro- I, I, I'm okay with it taking forever. Okay. So what do we do now? Uh, so now they get to pick the next category we're gonna do. You should probably put a timer on like how long we can answer. That's. We're so stressed about getting shocked that we're taking so a long time. Th- it's going to be them getting shocked versus on all these answers, huh? Yeah. yeah. Except for poker. Poker is no one gets shocked. Is anyone even shocked yet? Uh, they got shocked. They got shocked a couple yeah, once, right? With that one. Not at all. But them. we can just keep going. Yeah. Do you get negative for getting wrong or just shocked? No, shock? just shocked. Shock. You just get shocked. What is the, the wrestling federation called now? Is it still WWF? Nope, it's WWE. So these, these are older. older. I, I we call it WWE. That. We call it WWF regardless. Okay. And, and I believe really... there's a sp- special stipulation on the music. A gimmick match? <laughs> <laughs> on the music? Yeah, oh, it's <laughs> WWF music. I, mean, I, got, I can probably answer those right more. It doesn't matter. We're going to go to either of them. But I know. But we it's, can build a lead. Wood. Crush their spirits? Yeah. Huh. We'll go with basket, ball. All right. Space. Yeah, so that was fast. Okay. Um, location, location, location. Four seconds. Okay, what location? I don't know. Oh, okay. Ten. Oh, whoa! You have to say ten every time. No, we're not. That's a base. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna say ten. And they're gonna take control. Yeah, that's not true. No. <laughs> For a ten. For ten seconds. This team. Plays at the Verizon Center, oh, located in the Chinatown of their city. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> the mix? No, it's definitely not the mix. How <laughs> oh, the Nets? No, they play at the Barclays. Uh, how about Clippers? They play at the Staples Center. Oh, fuck that. Um, <laughs> Raptors. Where, where do the Warriors from? What's the name of that arena? That's not, the, that's not Chinatown, no. Uh, Toronto Raptors. I think it's the yeah. Verizon Center. Close well, No, Arizona is in Chinatown. What is Chinatown? It's New York, San Francisco, Chicago. We don't have a basketball team. I don't even know. Bulls? There you go. Could be Chicago. I think that might be right. It's a big city. It is. Yeah, we'll go with Chicago. Chicago Bulls. The Wizards. Ah, uh, yeah. We didn't have a chance to guess. No, because no, no, no. I gotta get shocked now, fucker. <laughs> you still want to get the points? Let me know. I'm gonna wait. Okay. It's gonna Ready? Be wait, wait. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Come on, highest. Come on, highest. Seven. <laughs> Ten. <laughs> He's rolling. <laughs> That shit sucks, dude. That shit does suck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, team one. You peed a little bit, Matt. <laughs> oh, it's us? We can make a true story when none of us go over. Because no, our teammates can still fuck us. Uh, go back I don't know what any of these mean. Uh, go back to Russia for 10 seconds. Whoa. <laughs> Not fucking around anymore. This is the only non United States team currently in the NBA. Raptors. Oh. Is it the Raptors? The only non United States team? Yeah, it's gotta be the Toronto Raptors. <laughs> yes! <laughs> like a boss. Ten seconds. No. <laughs> <laughs> He's just gonna do ten seconds every time. But they didn't get it right. We're still ahead. We're right. it. You, you said that you were confident in this one to take the lead, so be confident. I wouldn't have got Verizon Center. The Wizards? No, I wouldn't have. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Like a boss. Hey, hey, I'm listening. <laughs> Th- this team's captains include, or have included, Bill Russell, Reggie Lewis, D. Brown, oh, okay. and then from 1980 to 1983, none. The 
Celtics. Fucking non Celtics. That is correct. Good job, man. Did you get it wrong? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you <I> did. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Ringers, 10. See, he's just going to say 10 every time. But we're still ahead by a word. It's 4 to 1 right now. There are three teams to have never lost 60 games in a season. Name two of the three teams. Lakers? Uh, I'm pretty sure Lakers is one of them. I'm thinking, like, I'm trying to think like, of, like, newer franchises. Never, that ever? Never, that long. Yeah. Uh, the, who, who, who did the Hornets change to? <laughs> the Bobcats. Are, are they good? No. They, I think they held the record for most losses in a season. <laughs> <laughs> Sixers? No, Sixers, they sucked in the earlier. I want to say the Lakers and the Celtics, just because they've always been good, but the Celtics have had some pretty bad seasons. Plus, they've been around for what about the Royals. <laughs> no. Isn't that baseball? That's what the Kings used to be. Oh, cool. I'll, I'll go with that. King, uh, the Lakers and the Celtics. Lakers is one, Jazz is the other, and then the Knicks. Ah. Ready? Jazz is, makes sense. Knicks, what, I'm kind of surprised by Is it one? <laughs> yeah. Ready? Yeah. Go. Oh, you put it on a different setting. <laughs> that was the same one. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. That's okay, okay. <laughs> Dude, that's a different one. I thought it was the same one. No. <laughs> that one looked like it was more tolerable. Was it? No. No, huh? It sucks either way. Did you see over. it? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so now we've got Ole for Team 2. When do you start the bid out? 10 seconds. <laughs> they haven't got one. Yeah, but they're just going to say 10, no matter what. So what? They keep getting it wrong. But we all, right, all, right, all right, all right, let's go. You could have got that right that they just missed. No, I couldn't have. The Spaniard, Ricky Rubio, was imported into this team in 2009. Oh, tight. Um, Minnesota. What's, what, You're talking about NBA team, right? Yeah, what's, what's their the Timberwolves. Right? Okay, okay. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> Easy ass question. <laughs> Ole. Threw me off. Ole sounded complicated. Or did you know the fighting or something? Did you know? Oh, okay. <laughs> didn't he come from Bar- FC Barcelona, too, or something? FC? You know what FC stands for? No, it stands for football club. Soccer. Team <laughs> one, sports, WWF music, or poker? WWF. Yeah, WWF music. Okay, so we're just going to... There's I'm a stipulation on WWF okay. music. I will play a theme song entrance. First person to buzz in gets to guess whose music it is. If you're right, five points. If you're not... You get buzzed for three seconds. Oh, yeah, but just don't say anything you're saying. No, I'm no, 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 no. I'm no, not saying. Just, no just, just say your name. But don't just Individual buzz in. Just or, buzz in. Or, no, or Anyone team, could buzz or team, in. Team, team. Yeah, it's a team. Team. I got this. Don't so you guys me. just buzz in to get in that shot. <laughs> <laughs> we just say buzz, or what do we just say? say just right. say whatever. Okay, first one. <laughs> Brad. Mankind, Mick Foley. That is correct. It's a maggot shot, right? Because <laughs> <laughs> I got him right. I know. See, what the hell? You haven't been shocked yet. Yeah, I have. You tested it on me. <laughs> oh, that's the only one. I wasn't on needle. <laughs> it wasn't on needle. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, laptop went. Like the mouse around. Number two. Hold on. I have no idea. That was actually familiar. I'm not gonna. I don't know. Well, I guess it's only three seconds. I might as well throw a guess if you have a guess. Alright. It's obviously something from the 80s. Um, Brad. Coco Beware. That is incorrect. Um. Brutus yeah. the Barber Beefcake. Oh, that's my second guess. Oh. 
You can just count to three if you want. I got it. Okay, tell me when. Go. <laughs> oh, man! <Okay. laughs> so there's a button. You, you got off, different right? settings on it every time. It's a surprise. <laughs> I did, I'm doing the first one from now on. <laughs> Number three. Oh, just... Do it again, Brad. Oh, uh. Nick. Oh, no. Isn't that a Razor? Razor Ramon? I think so, yeah. Razor Ramon. That is correct. I should have buzzed in. Well, he already said Nick. Oh. That squirreling tires threw me off. I know. Is that my money? I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Number three? Four. Four. Matt. Steve Blackman. Whoa! Yeah. What? I've never heard Steve Blackman's intro music. Well you want to uh, say how you knew that? Because I had WrestleMania 2000, and I played it constantly. Uh, I would have felt like a dick if I was wrong, though. <laughs> that would have been all right. You were confident. <laughs> So it's so hard to be confident and wrong? No, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. Number five. Yeah. Stephanie. What a thing down. Who the crown. Number five. Number five. Brad. Is it Hakeem? The Bushwhackers. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's the worst music. <laughs> I can't picture them coming out. Though. Ready? Yeah. Go. <laughs> That's cake <Okay>. time. <laughs> Things are now done. Team two. Baseball. Baseball. Oh, fuck. Romance. For how many points? How many seconds? Two. Six. I'll let them try. God, I'll cheat that time. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta be hooked up to that I thing. Feel like that that time. <laughs> and we got a pretty good lead, I think. Okay. Bromance. Baseball is the category. These two players in every single game make up the battery. Pitcher and catcher. That is right. Oh! I was thinking Derek Jeter and... <laughs> <laughs> like that's their combo name. Bash Brothers. Um, losers. I'll go... Uh, go right in the middle. I'll go five. Go ahead. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Because we're nearing the end and you don't want to get shot taking long on. Huh? I said because we're nearing the end and you don't want to get shot. Why am I going to get shot? Well, your next, whatever one you're on. <clears throat> I don't know which one I want to be on. I don't know if I want to be on. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Godzilla monsters? Or... <laughs> I probably want to be on video games, to be honest, because I think that the other team would take 10 seconds more often. Yeah. Okay. For... Losers. Baseball. There are eight teams with zero world record series wins. World Name record. <laughs> Go ahead. Sorry, I know what you meant. Okay. <laughs> Name five of them. Asterisk. Oh, five? Out of the eight. Oh, you motherfucker. How many guesses do you have to have net? Guess five to get five? Yes. What's the oh, question? That's fucked up. How many world record series <sighs> People, which team has, has never, never won gone? the World Record Series? Why do you go two? <laughs> okay. Does anybody get five? I, he already I, said I, ten. I, I can get five. No, out he of said five seconds. And they took oh, that. he's got an answer. I can get five out of eight. I just might have to take like seven guesses to get him. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure the Texas teams, neither of them have won. So Houston, Texas. What's that? Um, what's the mascots? Uh, Houston Astros and Texas Rangers. I I'm just thinking out loud right now. I'm not oh, okay. submitting official guesses. Okay. What about the Padres? I don't believe that they have won a World Series championship. Uh, uh, 
Houston, Texas, Tampa Bay. The Giants. The Buccaneers. The Giants don't have Rockies. I don't believe the Mariners have won one either. I think you're right about the Padres, but those are the five that I feel most confident about. Okay. Uh, Houston Astros, Texas Rangers, Tampa Bay Rays, or Devil Rays, they changed their name a couple times. Seattle Mariners and the Colorado Rockies. That is correct. Oh, I thought the Mariners won one. No, they didn't. I said I thought they did. It was the Marlins. Uh, the other three, the Nationals, yeah, the uh, Brewers, and the Padres. Right about that. Tells from a strange land. Two seconds. Five seconds. You been confident with anything lately? I'm not in baseball. I'm really not. Are you? No. Nah. Nah. Six seconds. <laughs> Eight. <laughs> Go ahead. Which country employs the Climax series? The Climax series? Like orgasm series. Climax. I've never heard of that. Let's try it. Uh, I've never even heard of that, so anything would be just a strict guess. It's it's called the Climax series. That's not a translation? No. Okay, so it's not like a Hispanic. It's not Japan. Well, it wouldn't be Japan because it would be called something different. That's what second, so it's not. It is a translation. <laughs> <Either way. laughs> well, yeah, because they play. Yeah. I mean, that's one of the major places yeah. where they play baseball. Yeah. Yeah. But I was thinking, like, Dominican. Uh, you know, those Caribbean countries, too, play a lot of baseball. So do a lot of um, Central American, South American countries. But Japan makes sense. They would name something the Climax. I know, like the Climax. What did you do, Climax? Yeah, we'll, we'll guess Japan. That's correct. <laughs> he yeah, gave it away. I got one. Oh, so yeah. good. Like, yeah. 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 I know, he, he I couldn't know. have lied to me. That wouldn't have been fair. He couldn't have told the truth either, though. <laughs> <laughs> Team one. What, There's only, there only one, one category. Left? Uh, stop it or wild card bitches, huh? Wild card two left. and stop it or left. Okay, um, wild card bitches for five. <laughs> I like how everyone looks at Brian and not Matt. <laughs> Matt's the guy that took that. <laughs> Six. Oh man, this guy. Eight. Let him have it. <laughs> no, let him have it. You'll get it. I don't, want it. I don't think I will. I'm not confident. Ten seconds. <laughs> I, was, I was being a team player by taking six. I was ready to take six seconds to be a shot. If you can handle six, you can handle ten. Dissension amongst uh, team two. There's no dissension. <laughs> Brian Dean Ambrose. <laughs> okay. Wild card bitches. Baseball. There were six teams that won wild card games between 2010 and 2013. Name three of those teams. Uh, what do you mean wild? What do you mean? Sorry. There's like a, to to enter the wild the wild card to enter the pre the, the play in one. Yeah. And what do I have to? How many do you have to name? Three out of six. Uh, Braves. Um. Matt is guessing for 10 seconds of shock time. <laughs> Pirates? You better clarify whether or not you're submitting official answers. I'm, I'm guessing them right now. Okay. okay. Um, Did the Red Sox win them all over? I don't think so. Um, Tampa Bay. Please clarify Pirates. What city is it? Pittsburgh. Okay. Braves, Pittsburgh, Tampa Bay are all correct. <laughs> Other acceptable answers, Yankees or the Gay Keys? <laughs> Baltimore or St. Louis? I have some on that. What's the current well, score? Got big on that. Uh, we've got... Me too. You guys have five right. Team one has... Seven, right? I think they had, last year was the first year that they did We're that. We're team one, right? You're team two. We only have five? Five, right. 
And they have seven, right? Yeah, but they have a bunch of three-pointer ones, though, right? There's no three-pointer. Where do you get three-pointers from? What? The, the three points were WWF. No, those, you, you get shocked for three seconds, yeah. but all of them are worth five seconds. Five points. Oh, I, uh, I thought it, you said three points. Uh, I thought, that's why I wasn't going for it. I thought we'd been answering more. No? Well, you guys you guys did the miscellaneous list, two and two. WWF, WWF music was three and one. Basketball, you guys got two. We they got three, one. I thought... You guys got Lack of Boss, Olay, and no one got Location, no one got Ringers, and they got Go Back to Russia. Russia. Huh. And then Baseball, they have three, you have one. Okay. So Production. stop for questioning the game. No, no. no. <laughs> that's, that's more than We have one baseball. Make it. <laughs> Doesn't one baseball make it six then? Uh, one, two, three, four, yes, yeah, six. So yeah, stop it is the last one, and that's me, right? Stop it for six, seven, eight. <laughs> Nine. Ten. Can we just say ten? I wasn't sure if he's going to get me shocked or not. Stop it. Stop it. The mercy rule is used when a team has dominated their opponent and is awarded to be the winner, usually after 10 runs or so. What is another name for the mercy rule? Huh. But there's no such thing as a mercy rule in baby. It's heavily <laughs> used in Japan. <laughs> <laughs> the climax rule. He <laughs> <laughs> just made something up. That's not from Major League Baseball. They don't have a mercy rule. It doesn't say Major League Baseball. It's just I know baseball. it doesn't, but... I would think it would be the slaughter rule. Like, <laughs> that's what we would call it. I have no other guess. The slaughter rule. That is correct. Nice. Other acceptable Good answers. Here's the climax rule. <laughs> knockout, <laughs> knockout rule. The Over. skunk rule. Or the run-ahead rule. <laughs> So now, now we could poker. Now we could safely remove. Well, uh, give me three seconds. Don't be a dick and give me more though. Uh, I'm I've got the timer because I'm offering to take it for free. That's so tight. You want to give us the time? Let me know when you're. I'll tell you when to go. All right, just do it. Go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! It was just like, like felt like someone was just like stabbing you. Oh, you get this up! Oh, oh my finger! <laughs> 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 oh, 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 did I not take it off? <laughs> What's oh, stuck on me? You get two pros. Oh, okay. oh. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. <laughs> that got my thumb. No, that got my thumb. No, no. <laughs> oh my you god! You one in your hand. How'd you do that for ten seconds? Took <laughs> it like a man, <laughs> yeah, dude. That one was. Uh, you did the. He did the. That was he a slow. All the different one. All of money. Yeah. That one was like a, a slow pulsing. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> it, it's almost like if it would have been constant, you could kind of just like suck it up. But the pulsing one just kind of like. <laughs> like, <laughs> man. I think one of the types up there. No? Oh, okay. Did I knock those down? <laughs> I knocked a couple mics down. Oh, <laughs> he air humped the. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Those are the ones that people used to like work out instead of working out, right? It's for muscle therapy. Like, yeah. yeah. So it looks all relaxing. Okay. Now we're going to play five games of poker. Everyone starts off with ten chips. At the end of five games, whoever has the most chips gets 20 points. Second place gets 15. Third and fourth get 10. Fifth and sixth get five. I will play as well, but blind, and I will not bet. If I win a hand... I divide the chips up equally into two piles and randomly select two people to get the chips. Is there a big blind and a small blind? No. So we're just going to be like, I bet two chips. Yeah, throw them in the pot. Right now, cards are being dealt out. Yeah, we could we could commentate. Okay. I have a good hand. <laughs> so Brad will start the bidding. 
Three chips. I don't know what's going on right now. I'm gonna put three or more. I think you can fold or you can call or you can raise. Right. I don't know what that mean. <laughs> <laughs> so if you want to just play, you can put in three. If you want to, if you think you have a bad hand, you can fold. Or if you think you have a really strong hand, you can raise. Yeah. I believe in a seven-handed table. I have a very strong hand. I'm all in. Wow. I will fold that. Oh, you're playing blind? Yeah. So what does that mean? Do you, do you automatically call or what? Yep. <laughs> what if you lose? Then you get all the chips. Oh, shit. So I'm heads up with the blind hand? Yes. I have ace of club and nine of hearts. I'm pretty sure I'm winning against a blind hand. I did not hit the flop. It's queen eight deuce. I don't know what there's a Joker card in there. I don't think that counts. Rules for playing poker, but with Simpson. Uh oh. There's a jack on the turn, so I could hit a ten for a straight. I'm just playing ace high, so if he has any pair, then he wins. I see a ten. Strip one on double. And a three. Ace high is good. Oh, I have fives. So I win what Brad and Tim put in there and all of Brandon's chips, I guess? I don't have chips. How are you playing by then? Huh? I'm because I'm the game master. What so what if, how, if he wins then he divides the pot up into everybody. Oh or two random people. Alright, I was confused. Wait, wait, wait. I'm doing to Tim first. Oh, okay. So this is mine? Man, I still, do you still feel it? No. Because I don't want to have fucking legs. <clears throat> Maybe I have more muscle, and that's what the yeah, head is. Probably right. <laughs> so, I guess because you're first, Tim's first, and there's no blind to call, so you could check, or you could put money in there. You don't necessarily have to put money in there. And do it again. Should be 16. <coughs> Brad guy's calling. Matthew Chavez and Brad are folding, and now Tim's contemplating whether to put the rest of his chips in. And Tim decided to call. So Tim's all in for six. Brian's in for ten, and I'm just gonna match that ten. And we're gonna put our cards up so everyone can see what we have. But you're not in, or you are. Ooh, I'm automatically have, in. Tim and I have the same hand, and which is ace five, and Brian has king three. So far, ace high is good. There's no flush draws or anything like that. It's queen ten seven. There's a deuce. Doesn't do anything for anyone. No flush draws. And a jack on the river. So Brian loses. Now we, Tim and I just have to beat uh, Brandon. Uh, I see an eight of diamonds. Potential straight or flush. Four. Ace high is good again. So Brandon loses. And split the and I are going to split what Brian put in there. So actually, okay. Oh, he put in seven? That's all he put in here because he lost three. Okay, so you're going to get three out of this, right? Hold on, I'll give you four. Right? That's very kind of you, Nick. Well, I mean, Can't I think of someone. Hey. Whose beverage is it? Your guys's? Are they from? Yeah, from the bottom. Do you know how to evaluate the strength of your poker hand, Sam? I don't know. No more than he thought. He's taking out the other joker. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you've seen the Simpsons where the Homer where he... Is playing poker and they play yeah. rules to poker. And yeah. the Joker comes out and the guy loses. They like what happened to your chips, yeah. right? They're all gone. <laughs> <laughs> the king did not hold. <laughs> it didn't hold. You were never ahead. So we played five rounds of poker. <laughs> is that what it is? Third game. And whoever has the most chips at the end. So that one's mine. The next strategy is paying off. Well, I mean, that was pretty good. I know. I mean, we shouldn't play that. You shouldn't really go all in with an ace high, but 
<laughs> Nick is making everybody think he has another ace. Oh shit, I'm getting some callers this time. Alright, so both mats have called. I think they both have 10, right? Because you guys aren't putting yeah. in their hands. Yeah, so I'm just going to put 10 out there. Okay, and now we're you want to flip them up. It's good for radio. Oh, oh. Matt, Matt Matty G. G has kings, and Matt Chavez has a pair of threes. Matty G with an eighty-three percent chance to win. <laughs> Jack four seven, nothing on the flop for anyone. Of course, Brandon's hand is uh, blind, so who knows. Matt, no, 10, 95% chance. 10 on the turn. Nothing doing for me or Matt Chavez. And another 10 on the river. So if Brandon has a 10 in his hand, he takes this whole thing. Oh, there's an ace. And a 10! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you won. You guys won. Why are we still playing? Because, remember, he distributes them. Oh, that's right. That's right. <laughs> you should distribute them back to us. <laughs> it's random dice. Oh. Where's the dice at? I think Matthew kicked it off the table. Right, right there. there. <laughs> During his seizure. <laughs> that's one. That's why. I, I, I knew on, it so be. one, two, three, four, five, six. That's Matt Gerber. Oh yeah. A little justice there. Yeah. New blood. Tim. Uh, yeah. Tim Wilson. Ooh, Tim's now the the. Uh, was it the chip, chip leader? I'm gonna put you out of those chips. <laughs> are you adding points for each round? Or what are you doing? Oh, you're crossing off. I'm not adding any. So Tim Wilson, I don't need to see your last name. You're on you're with Tim here. Tim is the chip leader now. I think Matt, Matty G probably is in second, and Nick is in third. So Brad's in fourth, and Matt Chavez and Brian are out of chips. For now. <laughs> so they don't get dealt hands when they don't have chips, right? Right. So you want to shuffle these cards? Probably get that first. <laughs> 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 so basically, your only chance is for Brandon to blindly <laughs> win a hand, and you randomly get selected. Is this the last one? Oh, Brandon. I think there's one more. Oh, you forgot yourself, oh. Brandon. This is this is four or five. This is Guess do you it. You should have gone all in. <laughs> All right, I'm in for 12, and Matt has called me. I have another ace. Keep getting aces. But you don't have kings again. I don't know why you called me with that, but okay. Matt has queen three. Nothing doing on the flop. Seven deuce deuce. Ten on the turn, so Matt's drawing to a queen or a three. Nothing doing. So ace high win. One by S. Oh, wait, I forgot the, the wild card. There's a six. Didn't hit the flop. And a king, so A side does win. And now I am shipping. Yeah. Sure. So one more hand. And this one's going to you first. Yes. Okay. Going in blind. Mm -hmm. Should have to follow the order. We're okay. done. But you, you're going to be in last place with them, though. Wait, 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 hold on. I, I, maybe I don't understand what's going on. The cross the line. It's the <laughs> it's the <best laughs> they'll, be, they'll be fifth and sixth. Oh, because they went out first? Yeah. Okay. Unless they get chips back in I on see. the ten. That's Leave true. it out there. Be confident. Don't even look. Don't look at your cards. <laughs> Brad, you first. You going for it? Yep. That's seven chips. Oh, he's calling me. Looks like Tim is contemplating a call. He has called. I am going to call as well. Five, six, seven. And Matt is all in for three. So we don't need to flip them up because there's still some betting that can be done between Tim and I. So you go first, Tim, if you want to bet more. I'm going to wait. You're scaring me. I guess I'll check too. You can say check or bet now. Well, I don't understand. It's not that official for me to put more in there, is it? If you, think you get, if you think you can get more chips, because whoever, if whoever wins this is probably going to be in the league. Mm -hmm. I'm going to stay in All right, I'll check as well. Go ahead, check a bit. Yep, same thing. Yep. If you have a you still checking? Yep. Okay, I'll check as well. I have a pair of fives. Mm -hmm. You get an ace every single time. He has a pair oh, of sixes. He's got a pair of sixes and sixes to beat him. There's a deuce and a seven. 
Looks like six the six Sixers six. are going to win. So Tim takes down the massive pot there. And Brad and Matt are left without chips. That means that Tim and I are the only two players that have chips. So we tied for third and fourth. And, fourth. and then Tim's in first. And I Does he have more? Because he had more before. Yeah. But third and fourth get the same amount. Oh, okay. That was fun. Yeah, that was cool. Good idea, man. The guy who doesn't know how to play one. The more hands you're up against, the less your odds are, though. When you're up against more than one hand. You're up against Brandon as well. So now we're going to Monsters? Oh, Matt Chavez was in here, too. He had better three. That's right. <laughs> in media. Ooh, I'm good. Yeah. I, I, know some, I know some about Monsters. All right, cool. You want to switch me? Yeah, sure. 